Now, Wave 31 Storm Tracker Chief Meteorologist Tanner Knust with 31 Triple Doppler. A hazy Friday across North Alabama. We hardly had any cloud cover, but this is the view from Montesano looking toward Huntsville. Hard to see much on our camera this afternoon and this evening as the sun was setting. Very uh, poor visibility with all that wildfire smoke lingering. We had poor air quality today. We are anticipating that will also be a problem on Saturday. So the air quality alert that was in effect today for Madison and Morgan counties has been extended into Saturday as well. Air quality certainly could be an issue for folks that uh, suffer uh, with that have asthma or any other uh, respiratory issues. Young children and older adults are uh, recommended to limit uh, a lot of excess exercise or a lot of activity outside over the next couple of days due to those poor air quality conditions. Currently in Huntsville, it is 72 degrees. The rest of the region in the 60s at this hour. It's going to be a cooler than average night with a low of 59 tonight in the Rocket City. A few spots may fall to the mid 50s for your Friday night. Quiet conditions expected overnight and early in the day on Saturday. Quickly warming up tomorrow morning, getting up to the low and mid 80s, close to the noon hour afternoon. We keep on climbing and a couple of us may get to 90 tomorrow afternoon. Forecast high in Huntsville is right at 90 degrees. Many of us will see highs in the upper 80s on Saturday. If you're looking for a day to head out to the lake tomorrow, it's definitely the better of the two weekend days to do so uh, with very low end chances for rainfall on Saturday. Much better chance at storms coming our way on Sunday across North Alabama as our next weather maker heads our way and we are overdue for some rain across much of North Alabama. So the rain aspect of this is a good thing. The bad news is we may get some severe weather in the mix uh, with this as well. Saturday looking quiet for the wide majority of us. If anyone gets rain tomorrow, it will be late in the day around the shoals or down closer to central Alabama. Huntsville very likely to be dry on Saturday. Isolated showers and storms will be possible late on Saturday night and early on Sunday morning. Just how widespread those are may determine how much storms, how many storms we see Sunday afternoon. Right now, our future radar keeps things relatively quiet for the first half of the day on Sunday. Certainly our best chance at rain is going to be on Sunday evening into Sunday night. That is when a cold front will move in from the west, initially affecting the shoals, say around 9, 10 o'clock, approaching Huntsville late on Sunday evening. And then that line of storms expected to quickly clear out on Sunday night, leading to quieter conditions as we kick off the work week next week. Level 2 out of 5 risk for severe weather in place for northwest Alabama into parts of middle Tennessee. That risk drops off a little bit to the south and east, but everyone will have the possibility of seeing severe weather with damaging wind being the primary threat. We could also see some large hail. If we get multiple rounds of thunderstorms, then that's when flash flooding may come into play. But that's uh, kind of a, a possibility, but not a guarantee to happen. Something we will be watching for on Sunday. Again, most of us will dry out Monday and Tuesday next week. High temperatures dip back down to the mid 80s overnight low in the upper 50s on Monday night. And then as we head toward Wednesday and Thursday, that will be another period we are watching for some scattered thunderstorms, some of which could be strong. Then we should trend drier as we close out next week and head into Father's Day weekend.